All right, we're up here in Santa Rosa, California. Ended up having to block four lanes of traffic to back into the door so that we can be first to be unloaded in the morning. And just like always, there's nowhere to eat around. So we're walking two whole miles to, what's it called again? Black Bear. Black Bear Diner. We're gonna see how that is. We'll let you know. Okay, so we just left uh, Black, Black Bear, Bear Diner. Diner. Go away, go away. We just left Black Bear Diner, and uh, I actually followed a customer out. I'm going to see what, uh, what they thought about it. Excuse me, ma'am, ma'am. Uh, what, what, what did you think? Danger, danger, danger. What did you think about the Black Bear Diner? Uh, would you recommend it to the customers on uh, the internet here? Yes, but drive. It is kind of a long way. It's not two miles as I thought. It's three and a half to the truck. It's not as bad as the big Texan. Yeah, that was that was five miles one way. Now we're doing well. It's six. It's six miles both ways. Seven. This is seven ways. Seven miles. There and back is seven miles. Oh, there, there and back is seven miles. Uh, but we've had some. Uh, had a Fitbit tell me that. Oh yeah. <laughs> we've had some stuff come up in the last couple days. Um, Obviously, I'm in California, so we got a new load, uh, and we had a couple firsts. Hi. You want to tell them about our firsts? I think you should. Uh, we got started. What was it yesterday? Day before yesterday morning, and we left. Where were we? Guyman, Oklahoma. Uh, we got started not five minutes into our day. Caleb got pulled over. Uh, yeah, yeah. Red and blues. Woo. Uh, what had Sir, happened was... Do you know why I pulled you over? What had happened was, uh, you know, I weigh 80,000 pounds. The speed limit was 45 miles an hour through town. I'm doing 35, but nonetheless, it was too fast. Light turns yellow. I had no time to stop. I even attempted to stop and realized there was no stopping. It's 5 o'clock in the morning. We started our day at 4. Uh, it's like 5 o'clock in the morning, 5.30. So there's nobody out. Uh, so I gas on it. We're gonna we're gonna make through this light. Well, sure enough, I get my nose through the light. Light goes red. Keep on going, and then, oh no, look in the left-hand lane, and there was a cop sitting behind another truck. Turns his lights on, uh, gets behind me. Then there's nowhere to stop. So I drove for what three three or four miles with yeah. my flashers on because I had nowhere to go. Try finally to pull over. Him. Yeah, out running with my flashers on, doing 25. Uh, I finally pull over. He comes up to the window. He says, uh, sir, you know, I pulled you over. I just kind of grinned and said, yeah, I know exactly why you pulled you. Pulled me over. I said, you know, I'm pretty heavy. Uh, I couldn't stop at that light. He's like, well, you need to slow down and, and make sure. Give yourself more time yeah, to stop. Yeah, give yourself more time to stop. Like, buddy, I was doing 10 under. Anyway, he only gave me a warning, so got away with that one. And then the other first, I've been driving for six, seven months now, I guess. I have yet to have been pulled into a way station and actually have to get out. Well, I go into this, I have the way stations open enough to get called in to get scaled, but never have to stop. I pull up to the thing and the light goes red. It says stop. Well, I look at the window and the guy has a sign. He's holding a sign out. It says, uh, pull over and come inside, bring your bills. That's like, wow, come on. So I go inside and he goes, okay, we're going to do a class three inspection on your paperwork. Make sure everything matches up. Luckily, I got out of there without any violations because I could have easily had a ticket right there and there too. And that was pretty much the excitement of that day. And then yesterday, Kristen had her first 600 mile day. It was a lot of, <sighs> when are we stopping? Are you hungry? I need a pee. I need a pee. When are we stopping? Are we there yet? Are we there yet? Yeah, it's like, no, this is, this is what happens. Well, I'm bored. We'll watch TV. Well, I can't hear it when you're driving. You know, it was just a day full of that. It was all right. You know, I think she enjoyed parts of it. But then we had today. Today was pretty exciting. I actually got up when Caleb got up. Yeah, yeah. But I got up the later, uh, later today than I've gotten up all week. Uh, 
we got in we had stopped in Barstow California last night and we only had 450 miles to go to get up here to uh, San Santa Rosa and so San Jose. whatever uh, where I'll see then what happened we uh I'm trying to navigate traffic here the lack thereof I need my vest yeah she has safety vest on uh, earlier but uh, we had to go up through San Francisco we got to see the Golden Gate Bridge from a long way away got to see the uh, Alcatraz Island obviously couldn't see the building very well but that was really cool Kristen's first time to California and she got to see the Golden Gate Bridge that's actually the first time I've gotten to see it even though I was up in San Francisco once before and now we're when we showed up here they were closed this place I'm dropping off at in the morning they told me they had parking on site and then I could show up and back into the door and I you know kind of cheated got got in line first nobody can they can get there early in the morning but they ain't gonna beat me because uh, I'm already back into the door they just have to show up in the morning open up their door and unload me that's pretty much the extent of the last couple days anything else we're missing getting a lot of exercise in more so than we did when well, I did when I was by myself we were gonna do I was gonna do a video driving yesterday and today yesterday we ended up just getting bored and uh, losing track of stuff and you know getting lost in conversation or then also lack thereof certain times uh, and then today I was gonna do a driving video we went down a couple mountains but I didn't want to show you all my nasty windshield now that it's warming up there's bugs all over it so i know the it looked like he's watching you know a 1950s movie it had been all pixelated no no it's just the bugs so maybe when i get my windshield cleaned up we'll do a uh, mountain video i know jessica wants to uh, see that there hasn't been any adverse weather yet and it doesn't hurt my feelings but we'll get to that too you know us doing this video has helped this part of the walking so far yeah, killing time, walking three and a half miles. So seven miles round trip, won't be too bad. I need to walk off all these pancakes. But if you're ever in um, Santa Rosa, California, go to the Black Bear Diner. Uh, it was really freaking good. They have many other locations. Yeah, I was gonna, they, they get these cool menus that look like newspapers. Let me model it here. And actually right here, there's a whole list all the way down to the bottom of the page of their locations. It's only in Arizona, California, Utah, a couple in Nevada. Uh, they don't venture out of the state very far, but they've got a bunch in those states. Anyway, pretty good. Uh, I think that pretty well concludes it. And we'll uh, catch y'all next time. Take it easy. Buddy.